Hello and how are you all today? My name is Priyanka and the question says give one example of a situation in which firstly the mean is an appropriate measure of central tendency and secondly the mean is not an appropriate measure of central tendency but median is an appropriate measure of central tendency. So give an example for the first case here we can say that giving an example where the mean is an appropriate measure of central tendency is to find the average marks scored by students in a test and we are given the marks of five students that is five seven eight three two so with the help of this measurement or these observations we can find the average mark scored by a student in a test this will give us an appropriate measure of the central tendency while in the second one we need to tell that mean is not an appropriate measure of central tendency but median is an appropriate measure so the example which can be cited for this is let's say the example 15 of your book here in which with the help of the given data we were able to find out the mean, median and mode of Harry and Mary that is 8.2, 8.4, 10, 8, 10, 8. So here, now on comparing the three measures of central tendency for the given data, we can see that the mean salary of 7000 does not even give an approximate estimate of anyone's their age whereas the median and the modal salaries represent 5000 of the data the extreme value affects the mean and this is the weakest point of the mean so if the data has few points which are very far away from each other like 1 7 8 9 9 so here these two values are very far from each other then the mean is not good and is not a good representative of this data since the median and mode are not affected by these extreme values presented in the data they give a better estimate of the average of such a situation so this is an example where the mean and mode is an appropriate measure of central tendency than the mean right so this completes my session. Hope you understood the difference between mean, median and board and in which cases they are suitable to find out or to compare the given observations. So hope you enjoy and have a nice day.